there was a strong demand from our customers to extend the, uh, the, variety, the variety of chassis to an 8x8. And that's how we developed the, uh, the model that is showcased today in Eurosatory, uh, which is based on a Tatra 8x8 chassis. Having an 8x8 offers more payload, so basically it widens the range of options that all customers have if they want more equipment, more ammunition. And I'll cover this in a, in a, in a, in a, in a second. Having more payload allows the customer to customize its uh, equipment. So if he wants more armor, you can have the cabin, uh, such as the one that you see today in Eurosatory, which is level 3 ballistic and level 2 mine. Uh, if he doesn't want any armor, it can be a simple uh, a protected cabin, but it's uh, scalable. They are, the protection offered to the crew is scalable. The other thing is having more payload. You can uh, accommodate more equipment, such as uh, uh, smoke dischargers, anti-IED, electronic uh, countermeasures, uh, secondary weapons, you name it. Caesar is one, before all an artillery system. It can accommodate 30 rounds uh, versus 18 for the Caesar uh, 8x8 for a gross ton or a gross weight of 30 tons. Uh, also having more gross capacity we have developed a automatic loading system that is not that is not on the 6x6 which is semi-automatic as you can see behind me there's uh, the racks are separated in columns of two uh, rounds each and this allows a automatic loading system to come and pick the rounds the desired uh, rounds for each fire mission and to bring them all the way back to uh, the chamber so the process is for the shells is fully automatic. Uh, there's no human intervention uh, during uh, the fire mission. Once the, uh, the ammunition has been grabbed by the pincer, they are brought back to the rear of uh, the scissor, where a handling arm is taking the shell and is to put it into a loading tray. What is new compared to the 6x6 is we have added a loading tray for the charges. So uh, instead of having the operator to take the charges from the charges uh, rack and put it into the chamber manually on a 6x6, now the operators just have to put the charges into the loading tray and uh, eventually the uh, loading system will put the shell and the charges automatically in the chamber. Caesar is equipped with state-of-the-art equipment in terms of firepower that is an inertial navigation system coupled with a GPS but also a um, muzzle velocity radar that you see behind me in two parts. Uh, the reason is there's one standard uh, traditional mu mu muzzle velocity and the other one is for Spacido to set the, the fuses on Spacido, the course correction uh, fuse. We've also introduced a thermal imager uh, for direct fire, which, give the, uh, which will give uh, Caesar 8x8 the capability to, uh, for di direct firing even at night. So basically, in a nutshell, uh, the difference between Caesar 6x6 and 8x8 is the good ordnance that has been combat proven, uh, but a new chassis offering more options to our customers in terms of payload, protection and automation. Today you have to make up scarcity with high mobility, being able to move your artillery from one end of the front line to the other end, uh, knowing that the front line won't be continuous. That's, that's I think, where uh, mobility is really, really a key factor, uh, be it in Africa or in Europe or elsewhere.